keeping a watchful eye on her, making sure nothing happens, uh, she doesn't become a victim again. Um, it, you know, it was a little tough the first year, and then you know every month would go by, and then two years went by, and I kind of got to the point where I knew she was never going to look back to that lifestyle again. So, um, just once again, just very thankful how it how it ended up. You know, that means a lot because with crystal meth users, probably only about seven to ten percent actually do recover. And to be truthful, for many years, I really. I really thought, I don't know if this is really going to happen, if she's going to recover. I was at my wits end. I think it was three days before I was with a friend. I was in tears. I was 50 years old, raising a five-year-old. I'm saying, I don't, I don't think she's ever going to recover. I don't think she's ever going to change. And I, I remember my friend saying, well, let's pray right now. So she prayed with me. I couldn't even pray. I was just spent. And um, she said, God, I just want you to show off. And four days later, he did. He really did. <laughs> I think, you know, in the first line of the Purpose Driven Life, it says, you know, it's not about you. And I remember telling Ashley, this is not about you. You know, you've got to look beyond gratifying yourself as a drug abuser. I said, you, you, got, a, you got a child, you got a, a family, a life. You, you, you need to really stop and think about what you're doing. So. Um, yeah, it's been a big impact, and I counsel a lot of young ladies, and I have through the years, and I think it's a, it's a great book for leading people and pointing people into the right direction. Yeah, it really does. It really does. It's just not them, and it's the family members, and um, I'm just thankful for her mother. My sister passed away. She got to see a hole and clean Ashley. It was a real gift. She did a great job because Ashley was really thin at that time and you know and they did a great job with Kate doing that just that portraying that um, sad person at that time and a person that seemed hopeless or um, just seemed like it had no direction and so Kate did a really good job. Mimi, I thought Mimi it was uh, when we met um, I thought oh my gosh I, I feel like I'm looking at myself you know <laughs> she was she was cuter <laughs> but anyway she um, yeah, she did a great job. I would say she might have been a little more conservative than me in the, um, in the movie. Um, but anyway, yeah, she did a good job uh, portraying me and my tough love that I had for Ashley during that time.